ready, you don't have to be a chef to prepare your favorite tandoori chicken with the Prestige Air Fryer. You can now make this at home the smart way. There is no mess with the Prestige Air Fryer, no odor, no smoke, and more importantly, no need to clean elaborately after the chicken is done. The Prestige Air Fryer comes up with a very, very sturdy handle. So just in case you want to make this outside of the kitchen and take it outside, you could do that. Now let's make that flavor-packed tandoori chicken with our Prestige Air Fryer. What you need to do is cut your tandoori chicken the way you like it. And then what you do is you take the chicken and you need to make some incisions some, so that whatever masalas you do get nicely inside. So you do this with all the pieces that you have. And what you need is you need to make the marinade now. Um, what I normally do is actually put all the dry ingredients first before I put it in the curd. So first we put some salt in this, not too much because there are some other ingredients with salt, for example black salt. So you adjust it to your taste and there is some chaat masala and uh, there is some garam masala and some red chili paste. Mix all of this and uh, leave it for a while. And after you've done this, then you put yogurt, curd as we know it. You need to put some kasuri methi, this gives it a nice little flavor and some ginger garlic paste as well. There you are, your marinade is almost done. And then leave it aside for a while. Okay, now what we're going to do is actually start making our tandoori chicken on our air fryer. To do this, what we need to do is actually preheat the air fryer for 4 minutes at 180 degrees, which I'm going to do and show you now. So hold the power button for 3 seconds, it will come on. And what you see is a default 180 degrees mentioned there. Now we're going to set the time for which, for which you press the timer button. There's a default 10 minutes that comes on it which we're going to reduce to 4 minutes and press the play button and it's done. Okay, now that the preheating is done, we have to now start making our tandoori chicken. So for that, we have to pull this out. Now we are going to lightly coat this fryer basket with oil. So we're going to take some oil. You can see that there's very little oil here. What we take is take this brush and lightly coat and then put our chicken into the fryer basket. That's ready to go. And now we put this back into the air fryer. Now we need to set the menu. So the good part about this is it's got ready menus for you. So for that, what you do is press the timer button twice. It indicates this blue light tells you which menu it's on. Press it to come to the chicken menu and just press start again. So it's a ready-made chicken menu, That's so you don't have to worry about what setting you're putting it in. It's ready, all the menus are pre-programmed and the chicken is starting to get done. Okay, as you can see now, the temperature has gone to 200. We'll just pause this a bit and um, take this out. Um, it's almost done. So what we're going to do now is baste this with a little bit of oil. So I'm going to baste these chicken pieces with some oil. We finish basting the chicken, put it back, press play like you would play any movie. And this is going to finish in five minutes from now. Okay, when the beep sounds, the air frying is now complete and our delicious tandoori chicken is now ready. So what we're now going to do is actually take this out and there you are. Add some black salt on top and a little bit of chaat masala and finally some lime to go with it. We have our tandoori chicken ready in a chafee.